Toby Jizzle, my friend, went to see the Northern Lights. He's, he's waffled on about this for time, and he's finally made a documentary about going. It's 30 minutes. Thank you for the color change. All right, here we go. I'm excited for this, you know. I've seen, I've, I keep getting TikToks of this. And every time I get one, I have to swipe away because I'm like, I'm going to watch it. So here we go. Are you telling me? If anyone has seen this, let me know. Hello. What do you think? What it do, baby? What it do, baby? Ah. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, this looks eventful as hell. I couldn't believe that just happened. It's not his first time in Iceland, no, but basically the last time he went to Iceland, he didn't get to see uh, the see Northern Lights. So he, he's always said he wants to see the Northern Lights. So this was like his, I'm going there and I'm staying until I see it. One of the most expensive places to go. Yeah, this trip has ended up being so expensive. Oh, We're shit. literally going for like, Yo, chill. Some people got road rage, man. It's crazy. And it's coming to like... Toby talking about road rage. Oh, wow. Ain't no Around way. 20 bags. For everything that we're doing. So, today's sponsor <laughs> is... Air Up. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Run the commercial. <laughs> this video is brought to you guys by AirUp. AirUp's a water bottle that allows you to make water taste like your favorite flavors. And believe me, they've got a lot of those. The AirUp flavor pods allow you to experience a world of flavor using your sense of smell. The bottles use something called retronasal smelling, which allows the flavored air contained within the pods to be consumed. AirUp sponsoring everyone, they are. They sponsor me. As a taste of water, even though the water itself isn't flavored. So it's completely healthy. Your dentist, I promise you, your dentist is going to thank me. To make it work, all you need to do is Fill up your bottle with water. Damn, David, 17 months, by the way. Up, Appreciate and then that. Just sip it. You don't need to tilt it because there's an inbuilt tool. It is sick how it works, though. If you want to find out more yeah. or you'd like to purchase one for yourself, then you can go to the link in the description and check out Error. They're the oilers. Thank you They're the ones Aero providing you lot with content possible. because realistically, they ain't, YouTubers ain't spending this money. Yeah, I've got to go back to school days for this. From the, I think it was like year nine. Jeez, look at that. There's a look at that sideman clothing, by the way. Look at it. First time I heard about the Northern Lights, I read about it in a book. I saw the picture and I was like, this shit is crazy. I want to witness this and experience this in real life. And from that moment, it's been the first thing on my bucket list. She put some doubt in my head that we might not see the Northern Lights. Oh no. Why? What'd she say? She said it's a chance thing and I knew that already, but in my head, I was like, this time it's going to happen. And I still believe- That's the thing they can, you, you can like have a- so like, excited. there's a likelihood you'll see it, but it's all chance still. Have you seen? I've seen the Northern Lights, but it was in Canada. It was tiny and like not. I don't really count it. If someone's like, I've seen it, I'll say, yeah, I've seen it too. But if you're saying like, have you seen the Northern Lights? Not really. Ahmed, thank you for the 22 months. I'm looking for Northern Lights. Dear passengers, please pass. He's Prada, yeah. Jack, thank you for the sub. Where's your jacket? Huh? Where's your jacket? I don't have a jacket, mate. You are crazy. You are crazy. <laughs> you are so crazy. Yeah, that is... This is... Hey, he took yeah. bare people, you know. Let's go. I feel like a couple years ago, I would have ummed and ahed about it and worried about, can I make it work? Would it actually be good content? Will people care about it? This time, when I had the idea, I guess I had the conviction to just go and do it. So that shows how far I've come as a person in the last two years. This ain't that, that would be Maybe it's rich, rich, nice, air up. When we were in Finland, they, they had no wind. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Aye, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Okay, it's not that bad. Nah, this is like, this is like London on a bad day. Come on. Oh shit, this is bad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God. I never go on the Iceland team, you know. Every time we've done like hot v cold, I've always been on the hot team or like what? Toby lives in like a high-rise apartment. 
where we just sometimes we just sit up, like look over the balcony just see the stars and stuff imagine you can see it from the balcony it'd be such a nice view whatever whatever i want to see it one day it's death or something it's freezing <laughs> coins yeah yeah superstar <laughs> coins Elas, thank you for the conversion. JC, please take the 23 months as well. The boys head straight from the airport to try and find the Northern Lights. Imagine if they had seen it there, yeah, would they have just gone home? Would that have been the video? Walk out the airport, see it. Oh, that's cool. James, thank you for the four months. The main problem is maybe that, um, that it's a full moon. It's, it's bright. It's, uh, it's, uh... Gaudi, thank you for the prime. Uh, yeah, it, like, kind of fucks with your eyes. So, basically, it's, uh... Not helping. Is it always this windy? No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, Everything's it's against us. <laughs> oh, I've got it. From civilization. I've got it. You got it? It's there. It's very slight. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, see, see, that's slight. Not, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not enough. Yes. No way. Is that oh, you <laughs> 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 oh, oh, wait, you. <laughs> yeah, it's slightly, so slightly. I told you I can see it. That just looks like a cloud. It is sick, but it just looks like a bit of a cloud. This is so cold. Like, my hands, I've got gloves on. I'm going to double glove tomorrow because this is not real. Oh, I see it coming. I see it coming. Okay, it's looking better there. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, I know they're not staying. I know that that's not it. We saw it like... We saw... When I've seen it, it was like that. Maybe even a bit less. Like, it's, it's barely like... It's barely the Northern Lights, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's cool to see, but he's gone all the way there to see it. That's not enough. Snow, thank you for the, for the bits. It does look cool. I do want to see it. Man said we saw the Northern Lights first night. But Time. we still need to see it a bit brighter. <laughs> Time to go home. Jeez. That's what we got from the first night. Ignore the cracked screen, it's the screen protector. But it looks so much better on camera. <laughs> Not like, camera you can to camera. You see it with your though. naked eye, but you can't like see it in all its glory. This amplifies it. This is what I want to see. Better than this even. I'm greedy. Let me be greedy for once. This will be cool as hell to see I'm though. I'm so gassed. Yeah. Though. I'm so gassed. Right, these like started screaming like little girls. <laughs> but you want to see it in its like fullness. Like I, I imagine knew they do. that there was a chance I could see them better. So I had this satisfaction that I had at least experienced it, but also this hope that I could see it in more of its glory at the same time. So essentially I was like happy at both ends of the scale, if that makes sense. Wednesday morning. How are we feeling today? All good, all good. I'm ready for today, but not this. I'm tired, but we go. We move. Warming up. Warming up. Hey, they got Blue Lagoon. Right, this so is I'm one thing Blue I've. Lagoon. This is one thing I've always wanted to do. Although the things, I don't know if you lot all get them TikToks where it's like. Uh, expectation reality but the blue lagoon is like expectation and it looks so nice and then reality there's like 2,000 people in um, it a few years but this back, looks sick friends, and just getting into the water and soaking and feeling the heat and just relaxing it's like yo this is a vibe like look I at like it, it here. and I, at first they said hey, yeah you got like two hours and I was thinking we're not gonna need two hours we'll go dip in and then get on to the next activity but as soon as you get in that water you don't want to leave, man. This is the vibe. Oh, yes. Oh. Oh. This is like a hot tub. Oh my oh. I don't yeah. get in the water if there's a lot of people the there. I think one of the best there. things I'd definitely get in that. about being in the position that I'm in in life is the ability to bring people who otherwise wouldn't have those opportunities in to experience them with you. It's almost like living vicariously through them at the same time. And it really helps you enjoy moments that you can otherwise quite easily get used to once you're in that position. Look at it. Look at it. I want to go there. Color contrast is amazing. The blue waters in the buildings. It looks so cool. The thing is, I've heard you have to go at like, if you want it very empty, you've got to go at like 4 or 5 a.m. or 4 a.m. or something. Volcano. Ready, boys? Excited. 
we cannot take the whole thing, no. it's too far, but uh, at least we can see the edge of the... Curse is staying for 13 months. Sounds like fun and, and uh, but it's of course this hot molten lava spewing from the earth and you uh, die if you go into <laughs> it. <laughs> because people are just, people are cooking. We ain't picking up on spelling and, mistakes. Uh, and, and heating up coffee and stuff on the, <laughs> on the lava. I respect it. Everyone that we went with loved to try something new. Wants to learn as well as delve into anything that we, that we were about to See, I want to do a video like this for Sidemen. Not necessarily the Northern Lights because Toby's now done that. But this is like a documentary style. It's not, there's, there's still humor in it and you're still focused on... You know, you're still focused on a bunch of people and like you can still get their personalities across. This wouldn't work for side men. But that's just, you're saying that because of what you've seen, but we got to change it up sometime, innit? Everyone's saying, oh, you do the same thing over and over again. But then when I say an idea like that, everyone's saying, oh, I wouldn't work. Well, not everyone. So we're just so... It was do it when so it's your turn. No, this is the thing. You got, you got to understand, no side men idea, right? When, when people take ideas, it's not their idea. Like, for example, last week, weird restaurants. Someone has suggested it out of us, but then we've all built on it. And then someone's taken it. Just because I host, like, I hosted that one, it's not my idea. You know what I mean? Same with all of them. That's why I want to do this kind of video. So, but we all have to agree on it. Sick, man. Seven Wonders of the World, seven videos. We actually said about making that one video. We actually said at one point, we said about making it, all the side men go to one wonder of the world. And you take whoever you want with you. So I could go with Talia, cameraman, two other people, whatever. Whoever I want, I go to one. They go to one. They go to one. They go to one. They go to one. And we see, like, we put that all together for one video. But I think we may as well all go to each. Yo, chill, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is mad. Shoot! Lava, man. When I saw smoke coming from close to it, and what? It hadn't erupted for over a year. Me! <laughs> if you know me, yeah, you know I'm not on doing things that are gonna test my life. Standing next to Lama I love Mark, tests man. I love him. my life. I want to keep my feet on the ground and stay grounded. I would have never imagined doing that in, in a million years. I love him. Oh, didn't see you there. <laughs> Clear we skies. To do something that I have never take the 13. We're going well watching. Now, if I was with the side men, we'd probably have made a joke about someone's mum at this point. I'm hoping to see some serious northern lights. <laughs> as soon as he said whale, I was like, Harry's mum? The naked eye. Like, yesterday, I feel like was enhanced a lot by our ability to see it on modern technology, aka the mobile phone and your camera. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to see it in all its natural glory today. When I heard whale watching, I was like, yeah, I want to do that. I want to sit on a boat and look for whales. So we pull up, does sound I'm looking at this well. boat and they point to this like old school, wooden, almost rickety looking boat. And I'm thinking, I don't want to get lost at sea. I think what it is, is that when we do Simon videos, it feels, you feel a lot more pressure to make this content. We have content. to put on our overalls. Obviously the guy gives us a whole tour of the boat, everything. Toby's gone here with his mates. I know we're all oh, mates in the yeah. summer. He's gone with his so mates. We got the blue whale coming up. Film it. We also got See the what happens. orca, known as the killer whale. Mm. We also got the uh, porpoise as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that one coming up as well. The small one, the small one. Yeah, the small one. I ain't got a clue. Don't worry. Yo. What are you most excited for? What about the mink? You forgot the mink. Do you know what I'm actually excited for? The sushi. We ready. He's not eating the whales. You ready to catch some whales, bro? We're not watching, we're catching. Who's catching? I'm catching? Listen, Peter, I'm not involved in this. Or Peter, whatever it is. <laughs> There's a man shooting the whole thing today. He's toasty. I'm wearing a bin bag. If I need to swim. Okay, you're, you're He's fighting the sea. <laughs> Lara, think of the bits. Ben is cold. Ben is cold, to be fair. Anyone just know that was Ben McLean who uh, he filmed all this. Over my YouTube career, the last like 10 or so years, like I've been able to do so much amazing shit that I would never have dreamed of doing coming from where I come from. And the other day I spoke to like a really, really, like one of my best friends. She was saying to me about listening to essentially the younger you. I'm very lucky 
to have someone like Toby who does YouTube oh. and willing to take Fuck you his cutie. family on a trip like this. Like, it's something special. Not many people get a chance to even see anything, a quarter of what we saw. What a cutie. Hey, if, if Mark ever comes in this chat again, I want everyone to call him cute. All right. Everyone's got to say coins is cute. We've been out here for like, what, an hour and a bit now? Still no whales. And if we don't see one, we don't see one. It just gives me another excuse to come back and try and do this again. No, please see a whale. Another opportunity for a brand deal. I want to know how many people would have expected me to come and do this. I've been out here for the past hour. Past hour, I've been trying to find whales. We haven't had luck so far. Please see a whale. A couple men have given up. We're not giving up. We're not giving up. We're here. How do they give up? To a clip of Mark. Oh, that's that. Hey, that ain't giving up. You can wake him up and get him up. one good sign, though. What? The sky is looking clear. Very, very clear. So, Northern Lights, which is what we came for, we're going to find it. Seeing a whale would have been a bonus. We was all there on the boat for a couple hours staring out, trying to find these whales. The hope was kind of bleating, but I was still just staring out. As the sun went down, my my hopes are kind of just I'm fading so away. So cold. And then my objective was changing from watching the whales to watching the northern lights. So I was hopeful that we would see um, those instead. Ice bath. I'm definitely down for ice bath. Bro, there's an ice bath right here, bro. <laughs> also, they didn't see a whale. Oh, that's <laughs> They can go back at some point. Especially when you're not comfortable in the sea, Mark will drop. I'm that. No, I'm. Listen, if I step put one toe in that sea, I'm dead. Yeah, if I, if I fall in, it's over for me. I'm dead. Especially when you're not comfortable and, and you start panicking and doing the most. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I don't, bro. bro, bro I'll be telling you, I'm I'm telling you. I, please calm down, no, please, please. Yeah. I almost drowned in Malia, bro. You almost in... drowned in Blue Lagoon, fam. <laughs> <laughs> that was light. That was light. <laughs> that was light. <laughs> no whales today so far. We might see one in the night. Very unlikely. Um, but we are still waiting for the northern lights and the boys have said that we're going to do a hot tub experience while watching them so that's look it forward to that we <laughs> <laughs> i had to convince the boys to do the hot tub obviously we're on the boat we're freezing our tits off how what convince someone to go in a hot tub that don't make sense even in these massive jumpsuits our faces and our hands are like frozen the boys are like i don't want to go in the hot tub i don't want to go in the hot tub i said everyone's getting in the fucking hot tub so i have to convince them for like five ten minutes to do it matthew's going oh, i don't want to do it man do i have to do i have to I'm, like, I'm doing it whether you like it or not if you don't do it then you're ungrateful when i drop the ungrateful, wow. then they then they need it's a hot to tub what is going on? And they're screaming, <laughs> no one sits down for like literally, I think it's like two whole minutes, everyone stood up. <sighs> I'm like, shut up, shut up. We're in Iceland, shut up, stop screaming. Hey, this is a vibe. If we see Northern Lights like this, this is crazy. Oh, no, my feet are burning. <laughs> this is crazy. No, I put my foot in on you because I have washed like this. Move over. Do you like this type of video uh, where he does those transitions into a sort of interview? Yeah, I think the interviews add a lot. I mean, it's the same as um, Beta Squad do like their uh, well, in all the, loads of their videos, they do the interviews, and I think it adds so much to the video. It's, I'm in yeah. place, bro. Feel yourself. You're calm. And then eventually, everyone gets used to it. But Matthew's the last one out, and they're like, "Alright, let's not tell Matthew." They're thick as that. Like, like, let's not tell Matthew. Matthew getting into the hot tub might be one of the funniest things I've experienced. He gets in and he's screaming. <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? 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 the hot the was Thomas like a cauldron, like a witch's cauldron. It was so hot. 
I was the last to come into the hot tub, so no one warned me. Like, I didn't see the others' reactions going into the hot tub, so I didn't know how hot it was. And I got in, oh my, it felt like my skin was peeling off. It was crazy hot. This is so nice. This light is blinding me. Fucking you, my bed dying. That's fucking Bro, why is it Jeez! I mean, this one's actually getting bright. What? Come on. This is crazy. This is actually nuts. Situations like that really do put into perspective the value of time spent in person with others. I feel like the social media age, we're all, it's, it's like a paradox. We're all so connected and yet so disconnected at the same time. So when you get an opportunity like this to kind of get away from all that and just be in the moment and be around people that you care about, it's really refreshing and it makes you really appreciate the people in your life. Oh my God, look. That's sick. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. In the hot tub as well. Oh my god, bro. Yo. Oh my god. How can we chill? Yo, yo. Hey, why is so. Hey, Toby, get off your phone, man. You're filming it. You've got it on film. He's talking about hanging out with his mates. Get off your phone. Over here on the left. Yo. Oh, shit. What is going that on? That is, that's mad. I was there like, a little old me, Toby Brown from fucking Hackney is here in Iceland on a boat in a hot tub staring Mark's at the new lights. This is something I've been <laughs> dreaming of since I was Seven men in a hot now tub, they're naked. Doing it for real. Seven degrees or in the hot tub in the middle of the ocean. Like you wouldn't even imagine stuff like that. That's so then seeing the lights no. with all your friends in a hot tub is so random or so amazing. I don't know, that was a very special moment. Like I even know how to describe it. It's just special. It was just one of those moments like, bro, this is actually happening. And you have to really kind it of- It is weird, isn't it? A boat. It's a lot, a, man. Like a ship. It's a lot to Not even a in, boat. But it was like- A ship. It's just one of the- In the middle of an Iceland the time. That's lake. That's crazy. Seeing the Northern Lights. I'm greedy though. I want bigger flares. Send me more. <laughs> bro, look That's how far this nuts. goes down though. It goes all, it comes all the way up here. And then there's a one, one coming yeah. from the bottom there as well. We went to change to run up, put on clothes, maybe get some pictures, and it's gone. Crazy. Just like that. Wait, that one in the hot tub. Ben? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it goes that quick? Crazy. 11th hour. <laughs> Weird phrase. Felicia, thank you for the tips. Over 39 months. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much. And Oogly, thank you for the prime. Kazzy, thank you for the year as well. Appreciate that. <laughs> it's a quick one and done. Mad. I didn't right, know so that. Let's get to this um, geezer, geyser, whatever you want to call it from wherever you're from. Geezer. I'm a lyrical geezer. I'm going to keep trying that. <laughs> It's coming, it's coming. There we go. Ah! We was waiting because there was one that was particularly active and it'll go off like every three, four minutes. It created like a really funny scenario where we was just all messing about with each other and teasing each other. And I guess that just comes from friendship groups in general. Well, regardless of the situation you're in, you find a way to just kind of mess with each other and make each other laugh. It just it happens. All right. What up, Brandy? Time, time a photo with the eruption. What happened? The Geyser. 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 <laughs> Why is he crying? I don't okay. It's okay, bro. Don't worry, don't so worry bro. No. Oh! Oh! <laughs> right now, we just have to wrap up so warm because we heard it's minus 17 degrees. 17? On the top of the glacier. So the boys are wrapped up, scarves, valleys, everything. Also, this is the truck that we're going up in. This is crazy. The world is as big as me. Why you do your wordle? Look at this thing. We're watching Toby yeah. experience life. Fuck getting run over by that. No way. Alright, on we go. Hey, this is shot so well. You get to like a barrier and a barrier literally says, if you proceed, proceed with caution is like, basically if you proceed is on you. Like if anything happens. That, that sign, I don't know why it made me think of it. The trailer of this looks sick. This is really sick. That made me think Toby has always said 
He wants to go storm chasing. And now that he's done this video, I wonder if he'll ever do a storm chasing video. You're stuck. Every five minutes, you're filming? To check the time. Give me a word, start my wordle. Um, storm. I was thinking, what's going on? He's releasing pressure at the tires. He's telling us it's one of the most icy days, so they have to be careful. <laughs> We're literally sliding all Wait, over the place. Hold Look, Mark can't hold the camera still. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I'm so excited to get out of there, I can't lie. It's gonna, no, oh, oh God, I can't wait because once I get out of there, I know there's no, no turning back. Whilst we're on this bus, I feel the warmth. I'm, I'm, ex I'm thinking, yeah, maybe I can go home. No, I can't go home, bro. Get inside this little base hut thing, get changed, put our clothes on. And basically, in all these safety oh. briefings that we ever do, they scare the shit out of you so you don't even come close to killing yourself. Going outside, I'm gonna get a climber Oh, shit, it's so windy, boy. Oh. Hey, this seems like it's been the maddest holiday, you know. This is the third bro? world. It is so windy Second out day. Here. When we put on all the gear, we go outside. Oh, is the clip will be in there where I drop you a camera? Yeah. <laughs> Bow. I drop straight away within 10 <laughs> seconds. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. This feels a little bit different to the one I went on in Finland, so I'm a little bit nervous. But at the same time, they scare the shit out of you enough that you don't do stupid shit. This is where you cut to us, dude. They did drop 20 bags. Yeah, but there's like six, seven of them or something. Ooh. Oh. That could have landed on his leg. Mark was ahead of me, and this guy's driving like one granny. I'm telling him to hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. He's not speeding up. Thought I'll take matters into my own hand. Press the accelerating button. Oh my god. Bro, these are flipping. <laughs> SB! <laughs> First five seconds. No, what? I know. I, I had to regain consciousness in my legs because I couldn't believe that just happened. My legs, I was just thinking to myself, rah. Did that really just happen? And the footage is incredible. I love the footage. It's so perfect. So perfectly captured. Look at it! Look at it! That is not. First of all, the views are incredible. Incredible. We're just all on snow, we're just driving through the snow, nothing's around us. I just, I don't know, it did it for real. It actually did it for real. Toby done a madness, he has. Although, if he hasn't filmed, if he hasn't filmed anything from his, for whatever song he's got next coming out, I want to see it, I want to see at least a little bit of a music video from this. My face is frozen, I can't speak properly. That is the best thing I've ever done in life. Like, hands down. Number one. But yeah, that was sick. The boys loved it. We all made it back in one piece. I think everyone fell over except Mark, because Mark was going snail's pace. Shout out Ben on the lens, because he's been doing a madness. Droning, taking photos, filming. He's always Crazy. been on- After snow. He's always been, been on the cold team for like sidemen stuff. Ben is so sick. Like all of that stuff, capturing all of that is, he's Got the he's massive really good. back down to the base. Yeah, then we got driven to, I guess you could call it a countryside like complex. And then we went to dinner, restaurant. Okay. Place. Some guy was playing piano and it was a vibe, man. It was very chill. Three, two, one. one you have to finish it. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> They're playing odd zone to do shots. Um, we just got marked. And after that, we go back to our little house settlement. The boys get out the, the little chessboard and start playing checkers. I think all of the boys are kind of happy with what we saw the day before in the hot tub. Like we saw the Nova Lights and I thought, like, we were all kind of chilling, we were all kind of tired. Because I guess they don't know chess. how good it is. Didn't expect to see much more really. They don't know how Hello. good, like, how do you do? Tonight could do. be. And number two. 
too much information for you. So there's a uh, there's, there's, there's some northern lights outside. What? A little bit. Northern lights. A little bit. Big line above the house. Right now. I want to see that one of Oh, crazy. That's so crazy. It's so green. <laughs> <laughs> But that one's I'm geeking out for That is so green. That it's one's actually green. green, yeah. That's so oh, nuts. I got goosebumps. Yeah. I've achieved the number one thing on my bucket list. Yes. Storm chasing's got to be up there for him now. Perspective right now. This is what we're dealing with. Goes all the way over the house. Ah! And I'm, whoa! That is so cool. Toby. Yeah. This is the clip. Toby, Toby, Toby. Front door. Look, look. This is the clip I saw. I I'm thinking, why is the ISO so I high? And then I saw that. this is why. So I'm in bed charging my phone, trying to catch up with a little bit of work stuff. Like before I nod off. This guy behind the camera, Ben rushes into the house. Guys, you gotta come outside now. You gotta see this. You this see is the sickest. This this Randy, if you're still here, look at this. Oh, what's happening? What's happening? And then, yeah, the rest is on film for you to watch. Look at that! Oh, shit. Boy. oh my god, it's a crazy one. Oh shit! Oh my god. It's purple! Boy. <laughs> Over the house! <laughs> Boys, look that way. Look left. Look left. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! What do you mean you look up! <laughs> Marth is so funny. Oh. That is sick. Now he's making me want to go. I'm in my thermals. I'm so it's happening, it's happening. I'm freezing my tits off, but I don't care. The adrenaline's like heating me up. And it's literally the People plan for months to find the lights and miss it. Time. Well, they went for three <laughs> nights <laughs> and they saw it. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we didn't even the first night. Toby, you saw the decent second night and then this is And I was just in absolute awe. Just in absolute awe. It was. Like, am I really here? Is this really happening right now? They found a shiny Pokemon. Because, like, Pokemon. because like, I just never expected to see something like that or experience a whole trip like that. That experience there, yeah, that whole screaming, everyone, the whole reaction around it. Our last night, I'm going to see it like this in one of the best, like, it was just amazing, man. We were all excited and we all, we all knew what each other felt like because we were excited for each other. We were excited ourselves. And I'm happy for them, little man. one in a lifetime experience with your friends. Of like Me being there with the boys and first of all, them helping me with the whole trip and shooting stuff and just being Yeah, the fact that they went them over them so is I didn't have to do this on my own. I was very appreciative of that. But me knowing that this is something that they may never have got the chance to do in their lifetimes and they were there witnessing it and seeing their excitement and it just amplified my excitement. Wow! I'm so gassed. My journey is crazy. Bro, I can't believe it. God did. God oh, did! That <laughs> guy's like, the sky all was nights. green and it was moving. Imagine that's, the, the, imagine that's the best night for it. Like, that's the <laughs> best we've seen it so far. <laughs> it's actually big facts. They had it if. Hot tub. Hot tub. They literally, if they had, like if they had seen a whale, I don't think anything could have gone more right. Everything, like the fact that it was like first night, see it a little bit, so they've seen it. Second night, see it better. Third night, see it insane. Get in the hot tub, what to see it. They had the, they had everything. They had it perfect. Very blessed to be able to do this. Whenever I experience things like this, and think back on how far I've come and, and how crazy the journey's been. I always got to show my gratitude to the people who helped make this happen, which is you guys who watch the content and enjoy it. So thank you so much for choosing to take an interest in the stuff I do and in return, allowing me to be in a position where I can do this kind of stuff. And I really pray that God blesses you and gives you the opportunity to do the crazy shit that you want to do too. Subscribe, let me know where you want me to go next and I'll catch you guys in a bit. This is how they do hearts these days. Okay, nailed it. Yeah, new school. Come on. Not gonna lie, I think this vid would be better if it had subway servers on the side. <laughs> now we need that Minecraft parkour. That's all we need.
little Minecraft parkour where they're like bouncing around and stuff. That was a really good video. That was a really good video. That was half an hour. 30 minutes. I don't watch 30 minute videos normally. I watch some. Obviously, we're, I watch Beta Squad and stuff, but I don't watch much. Thumbnail let it down a little. Um, It depends because this is not like, this isn't the type of video that I think you should try and clickbait loads. And like, he could easily call it, you know, I don't even know where you could go, but he could go way more clickbait. But I feel like the vibe that it is and like the people that you want to see it, you shouldn't try and make it too clickbait because you want realistically you want the people that are going to watch it you want you want them to be the people that are going to sit down for 30 minutes and watch like a, a documentary so <laughs> gg toby although now i want to see you i want to see you make the same similar style storm chasing so good luck with that toby i said i said i just watched the video very good video you've said to me so much you've always said northern lights storm chasing you've always said those you've done the northern lights i'm just saying I'll do it. Well, there you go.